Hi there beautiful Thrivers. Welcome back to another video with Thriving in Chaos. Today we're going to tackle another envelope for my daughter's brand new binder. So thank you for being here. Click that subscribe button, like the video, and let's go. Hi everyone, I hope you guys are doing good. Yep, I did my nails. <laughs> I thought about telling you in the last video, but um, I just decided to wait and surprise you. I did my very own version of a rose. <laughs> anyway, let's go ahead and grab today's prompt card. If you're new to my videos, this is a prompt card. It's basically a conversation starter, so I'll ask and answer the question on the card in this video, and you guys can put your answers in the comments below. It's just a little something to help us get to know each other better. So today's prompt card is... I'm going to skip that one. Funniest memory. I feel like we did something very similar to that, so... Okay. I don't know why it's spaced out like that. What's the best compliment you've ever received? For me, that I was a good mom. I don't know why, but that one just gets me. I think because I feel like my entire life I have just wanted to be a mom. I used to be one of those people that thought, oh my gosh, the Lord is going to come back to the earth before I'm ever able to have children because I want it so bad. <laughs> That's what I always felt, and so I finally got my babies, I quit my job, I did the things to be all I could be for them as their mother, so if somebody recognizes that, somebody outside from my immediate family that is, that really just touches me. What about you guys? What's the best compliment you've ever received? Let me know in the comments below. All right, today we're going to tackle another envelope. This will be the last envelope I can tackle in the month of February. So I hope you guys don't mind. I know it's probably not one of the most favorite videos to watch, but your girl's got to get it done. My daughter is ready for her binder. So we already did one to recap last Friday. So we're going to start on the next one. And this one is going to be vertical. I'm so excited. I have not done a vertical envelope yet. So I'm going to stick this right up here. Hopefully you guys can see that. This is today's image. It is Chainsaw Man himself. And it's for car needs. So this is what we came up with. And we're going to do this envelope in a vertical fashion. Kind of excited. Um... Yeah, like I've never done a vertical, so this will be interesting. I'm not going to go through all the steps that I do to make this envelope possible. Just know that I use Sharpie marker, tracing paper, and some tape. <laughs> and then I just trace over this image, and then we will put this inside of the envelope with some cardstock backing just to kind of give it a backdrop, which you'll see me do in this video. So the rest of this will be time lapse, and I hope you guys enjoy it. I'll put on some good music for you. At the end, we will come back and take a closer look, and then let my daughter check it out and put it in her brand new binder. I hope you guys enjoy.
All right, we're done. So I'm gonna go grab my daughter, let her check this out closer and put it in her binder. I like it. Yeah, you like that? Yeah, I do. This was still a lot of detail. Yeah. Not as much as the other one though, but I tried to capture as much of the detail as I could. I was nervous about it. I was like, is it too much detail? That's why I asked you about it. <laughs> Not bad though. It kept me entertained while I watched the Alex Murdoch trial. <laughs> All right, go ahead and put yours in. It's weird. I've had to do it this way. Yeah. You want it in front or behind this one? Um, it probably doesn't matter. I'll do behind. Okay. Okay. Gotta make sure it's in this time. Mm-hmm. Look yeah. at that! I like that. Me too. I like the vertical envelopes. It makes me want to kind of do vertical. All right, like two down. We are going to do the third one. It'll be next month. Okay. All right, so we're going to take a break for the rest of the month because I have other things I have to film and stuff. But we got two down, and we got your binder ready to go. Okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> I think this moved. Anyway. So we are done. As I said, we finished her second envelope. It is looking so cute. I love it. I like the idea of the vertical envelopes. I don't know. It's just, it's starting to be my vibe and I kind of want to do vertical envelopes for myself. So maybe the next time I revamp mine, I will go vertical. I don't know. As long as you can get it to lay flat, I guess. It's like a little book. I love that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. I won't keep you too much longer. I will be seeing you on Wednesday for our WTF Wednesday, of course. I hope you guys have a good evening and a happy Valentine's tomorrow. As always, until next time. Bye.